You know what? I want. Oh, that's a locked door. Oh, oh! <laughs> hey, kids, Grandpa Lemon here, and today I'm once again playing the game Hello Neighbor. If you kids remember this game, uh, I'm not gonna lie, it's a little scary. Uh, Grandpa Lemon did not like this game the first time he played it because it made his heart race a little bit. And uh, when you get to be my age, uh, you know, you, you just, you gotta be careful. So, alright, I'm walking around here. And I apparently, I don't know if I have weird contacts in, but it looks, looks like I'm seeing the world through Steven Soderbergh's eyes. I've got the Steven Soderbergh, uh, filter on my, uh, glasses. Whoa! Well, who is that guy? Sir? Hey! Hey, I'm not on your property. I'm not actually, now I'm on your property. Oh, but look, now I'm off. Oh, what are you going to do? You can't do anything. Oh, now I'm on your property. Ha, 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 ha. Yeah, what do you get that? Oh, I, I probably shouldn't egg him on like that. That's not good. Oh, jeez. Oh, yeah, he's right behind me, sir. I was just kidding. Just kidding. I'm not actually in your house. Oh, my goodness. Please, sir. Sir, just leave me alone. Oh. Oh. That guy was scary. Did you see his face? What was with his face? That was a scary face. I mean, the the other, the neighbor guy was already scary, but that guy? Oh, I don't know. I do not trust him, so I'm going to see if I can bring him over a gift. Maybe. Hey, I just want to give you a turkey. Are, are, are we cool now? Are you going to try to kill me? Well, are you going to pick up the turkey or not? That's kind of rude. Maybe I'll go inside your house and uh, see what's up. Yeah, what do we got back here? Oh, look. I feel like Ferris Bueller at like the end of the movie. Oh! Remember when Ferris Bueller was running through his neighbor's houses? He's trying to get home. That's how I felt, except this one took a dark turn because I got murdered right after. Um, okay. Okay. So let's see, now I've got a cup. Maybe I can give him some, uh, maybe I can give him a, a drink of water. Maybe that'll make him chill out and not want to kill me. What do you kids think? Just go up here. Maybe I'll, oh, what's, what's this? What's, what's in that window? Did you kids see that? Is this guy like a recording artist? Maybe he's, maybe he's like one of those cool producers like Timbaland. Or Scott Storch. And maybe he makes beats in his living room the whole time. Yeah, maybe that's it. Oh, wait, no. No, these are all TVs. Uh, and, oh, yeah, it looks like he's a high-tech peeping Tom. Completely wrong. Uh, yeah, this guy is a straight-up psychopath. Here I thought he was maybe recording some music. And, no, it turns out he's watching every house in the neighborhood. Yeah. I mean, look at this. Chris Hansen would have a field day with this guy. Oh, my goodness. What a psychopath. All right, how do I get out of this room? This... Oh, oh, scary, scary music. Oh, jeez! Sorry, I found your house of creepy stuff. Okay. All right, so what do I know now about the neighbor? I know that he's basically like Billy Baldwin from Sliver. I don't know if you kids remember that movie. That's an old, early 90s reference to a film about a guy that set up cameras in his apartment building and liked to watch everybody. Um, just so you kids at home know, uh, that's highly illegal. Uh, you cannot ever do that. It's not cool to do that. Um, so just let that be a lesson. You know, you, you, you kids might have a GoPro or two and you might think, hey, I'm going to set this up in a place and record it. And I'm going to, you know, no, it's never a good idea. Don't ever, ever do that. Okay. Um, all right, so let's see what else I'm going to find. I'm sure if I'm going to find that in one room, I can only imagine what he's got in the rest of his house. Because this looks to be about, like, what would you could say? Like, I'd say at least a five or six bedroom house. So I feel like I have a lot more skeletons uh, to get out of this guy's closet. Oh, jeez. Right. I don't even know where he is, but I know when the scary music happens, he's usually right behind me. Okay, sir. Sir, you... Oh, oh, thank God. Okay, I think he's gone now. I think Grandpa Lemon is safe. Let me just hop over this fence. 
Let's see. Yeah, there you go. That's for scaring me. I'll throw some stuff at your windows. Yeah. Oh, what are you going to do? Yeah, nothing. Yeah, old Grandpa Lemon's got quite the fastball. Maybe I can throw this at him. Yeah, are you upset? Oh, how about that? Oh, geez, that didn't work. Oh, okay. Hey. Hey, sir, I was just joking. I'm sorry I smashed your windows. Okay, let's see if I can go around here. I don't think he saw me. All right. Let me see if I can just go up these steps here. Find something else. I, I bet I, I bet I find a... What do you think kids think I'm going to find? I, I bet I find like a dungeon. Oh, there we go. Uh-oh. He's on the prowl again. Yeah, it's a smash window. What are you going to do about it? Nothing. Oh, wait. What's he got behind there? Hey, what's in this door that you have suspiciously locked up? All right. I got to be real quiet. I think I'm, I'm hiding in his closet. Hopefully, I don't make any noise whatsoever. Do you kids hear him? Hello? Hello? Oh, I think he might be gone. Now's my chance to go upstairs and see if I can find any more creepy stuff. I bet he's got like a... I bet he has a collection of like human hair. I don't know why, but this guy just seems like the type that would have a collection of human hair. Right? You know, I mean, they say serial killers like to keep trophies of their victims. Now, I'm not seeing anything right now. Is it, oh, oh, jeez. Okay. You know what? I want, oh, that's a locked door. Oh, oh. Oh, goodness gracious. Oh, that scared old Grandpa Lemon. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm all right. Whew. My heart's racing, though. Okay. All right. Why is it so hazy? This is so strange. That's okay. Oh, Grandpa Lemon's phone was going off there for a second. You kids know that song? This is going to be the best day of our lives. You know, I should probably stop because, you know, copyright. And the way YouTube's been going, you know, any little thing you do, you can get demonetized. So, oh, I got to get back in there. Hold on, I got to pick that up and try to smash that window. There we go. All right. Now, maybe I can unplug this or something. Can I do that? There we go. Oh, the creep machine. I turned the creep machine off. Oh, I bet he's going to be mad when he can't spy on his neighbors in 2G. All right, he's not in there. Okay, what's in there? Oh, look. Oh, yeah, that looks like a jail cell. He's probably got victims in there, if I had to guess. I mean, what else could it be? Am I right? Okay, let's see here. How do I... Yeah, let me see if I can go into the other room. Perhaps. And by the way, look at that guy's parking job. Are we, are we going to talk about how bad this guy is? Like, he, he knocked down his own fence when he was parking. Which leads me to believe that maybe he went out the night before and he went to some bar, had a couple glasses of giggle juice, and then did the stupid thing and got behind the wheel to drive. You never do that. But, oh! Oh, boy! Oh, jeez! I, oh, I, I, I tried to get out of that window, but I knew as, I, as soon as I turned around, I, I could feel his hot breath on my shoulder, and I was like, he's right behind me. Oh, yeah, of course he's right behind me. Gotta say, that's like four times he's killed me now. You'd think I'd learn my lesson. Whoa, whoa what's happening? Whoa, everything's getting a little strange. Maybe I'm getting lightheaded. Oh, there he is. Hey, leave me alone. Get away from me. I'm in. Oh, darn it. Well, oh, I think I've had about enough of this video game. I hope you kids have liked it. Um, And don't forget, kids, if a neighbor really is trying to kill you, just remember to... <laughs> Let's <laughs> go.